These are the photos that Boulder police have sent out, hoping to find at least a few of the people involved in the destruction Saturday night on the Hill. Police haven't made any arrests yet, despite receiving more than 750 tips. John Glasgow is on the story this morning, and John, we're hearing from people living near that area that this is nothing new. Corey, neighbors who live on that block say that this has been an ongoing problem, that Saturday's party was a symptom of things that have been happening for decades. Now, will they Part, these students, they party night after night, and when the neighbors phone police, they say that nothing happens. So what is this, the solution to this? That is the big question going forward. A group of residents, CU Boulder administrators, students and police gathered for a Zoom call to discuss the aftermath of the weekend. Boulder police say students broke public health orders with the party, but those orders are tough to enforce in that moment. Students, they run into the house, they lock the doors. Police say that they could consider getting those search warrants to get in the homes, but they don't think it's best practice for a health code violation. On Saturday night, when the party escalated to destruction of property and violence against officers, police say they didn't have many options for enforcement either. We can't use that type of force when it's a mere violation of a public health order. We are walking a tightrope to disperse them without using force. There were students chanting, get out of our neighborhood. They think it's their neighborhood. Yeah, so there's no clear solution that came up from that Zoom call last night. Uh, what, but we did find out, though, is that the Boulder police chief did say that they do have some suspects in mind for the destruction of property at that party on Saturday. Uh, there's still some of those photos circulating online. They're trying to identify more people. So if anyone has any information, you can head to our website, 9news.com, to see those photos and help police. We'll send it back to you.